Good afternoon, welcome to the video and welcome to the channel. Today's video I'm going to be working on, well this, my 2009 Ram 1500. We're going to be changing the headlights to some LEDs because these headlights that are in this thing are just, they're absolutely horrible. I can't stand them. They are mildly dangerous at night if you go to drive this truck. It's really bad because you go to turn and you can't see anything. They're just so dim. I've heard this before with some Chryslers that they're very bad headlights and that's why I've got these. These are by, I'm not even sure if that's Sled, 7 Lead, I don't know. It's by Auto Father. They're pretty much the cheapest lights you can almost find on eBay for LEDs. They got this like aluminum structure to them, four sided LED. They got a built in fan and they are plug and play. So let's go ahead and get the Rams headlights out to put these in. And just in case you guys don't know, this is my daily driver. It is a 2009 Ram 1500 Laramie edition that has only been on the channel a few times. I've just showed a few things about it. Number one, that it has like a four inch lift, pro comp lift. Uh, I put this grill in it, which was quite a job to do. And I, oh, I did the angry headlight trick. That's actually a pretty easy thing to do to add some aggressiveness to your truck. Oh, I didn't buy it. I got this camper shell for free. I ended up cutting the front off, which is now failing. I gotta get this thing off. It was just used to haul stuff to the dump. Uh, I ended up cutting the front off and moving that back, and then I ended up taking out about a foot section of this, uh, the back piece, and moved it over and then screwed it all together and threw some quick bondo on it. This was just a temporary thing to get me a whole load of trash to the dump a few times, which I did do. All I gotta say is these headlights are just downright awful. I was, I'm, I mean, they're bad. They are just, they're no good. I got the fogs on, but they're just, they suck. We're gonna put the LEDs on and hopefully they'll be better. Well, that's just a bunch of shit. And I do completely blame myself. I did, in fact, say I want to get this done before it rains. And I bet if I didn't say that, it would have got done before it rained. The darn grill is held on with 10 mil bolts. And I don't really care for the metric system. And I don't know why Dodge put 10 mil bolts. I know everybody. Well, I know a lot of automakers do use the metric system now. It's just not my thing, I guess. I'm almost certain someone did one. Whoa. <laughs> I'm almost certain at one point someone did swap LEDs and this is some kind of item for that. I'm I'm not sure honestly what this is for. This is supposed to be here. And they ended up cutting this out to allow airflow, which is fine for what we're doing because mine will plug right into, I believe, this. Um, so all these do is these unscrew. They're supposed to be watertight, which is why I'm wondering if that's not supposed to be like that. And then your headlight, your main headlight is right here, which we unspot. And there's our cheesy, crappy headlight. Oh boy, it pays to have a third hand sometimes. So even the plug right here, I'm almost certain this is not right. Lights are on. Oh, I think I see it. Oh, <laughs> oh it's bright as hell. Wow. Probably not like this. Like a thing that got moved and shifted wrong. There's that one. That one's been missing. That one, that thing. Yep, I am too. Tools. I hear thunder. Yes, they work. And I paid $17. That's all I got for this video. I will actually include a few shots at the very end of this just to show you guys how bright it is at night. Hopefully it'll pick up good on the camera. The cameras aren't really good in the dark. I'll move the Expedition, I'll shine it on the uh, garage. I should have got it before and after actually thinking about it. That was my mistake. 
I'm sorry, but you're just gonna have to take my word for it. They were extremely, extremely dull. They were not bright. I mean, this thing, you know, I was driving it one night, and I was like, I can't drive this thing. It's that dangerous. It's so bad. Stay on these headlights, just remind me if I forget. Um, uh, so just stay up to date, subscribe to the channel, and you can kind of keep up to date on that. So thanks for watching. Give this video a big thumbs up. Please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Here, here you guys go. Ready? Those are just fog lights. So fog lights on and off. Kind of see. Bam. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh, that's, that's great. Wow. Okay, let's go for a little uh, little drive now. This is insane. Oh, I did it there. Oh, guys. The difference is literally night and day. I can tell you that made a hell of a difference. I highly recommend these lights right now. I gotta keep you guys updated. I'll upload videos like probably every week just giving you a quick update on the headlights, how long they last, are they any good, are they getting too hot, stuff like that.